Alright, so welcome to another how to dyno tutorial. Today we're going to be continuing on with our community made custom commands. This submission comes from hellohi821, yet another submission from this user. So thank you for participating. So basically what hellohi has created is a command that will hide dyno's response or output whenever you perform some type of moderation command. This is done by using the delete and silent command. The delete variable will go ahead and actually uh, delete the trigger command and then silent will hide dino's output. So since you're actually hiding dino's output, I recommend that you enable the moderation logs so that you can actually see whether or not the user was actually moderated. I'd also like to announce that I have created a Google form for users to submit your custom commands. So if you don't want to submit it through the comments, you can also use the Google form where you could submit it anonymously or provide your Discord username or YouTube username and I can shout you out as I did in this video. So let's get on to the video. To get started, head over to the Dinobot website, dino.gg and click on the manage service button. Then select the server you'd like to manage. Click on custom commands and make sure the module is enabled. Now let's add a command. With Hello Hi's example, he just used the first letter of each of the moderation commands. And essentially everything else is the same when it comes to the command other than the actual command name. So here we're gonna start off with mute and you can go ahead and copy and paste the actual command I'll leave it in the description and also create a pastebin link. Now all we have to do is copy and paste our command. So this is for mute. So as you can see here, we have delete, which is actually going to delete the trigger text and then silent, which is going to hide dino's output. And then the actual command down here at the bottom. And this is pretty much it. If you want, you can add a description explaining what the command does or what it's used for. But in this video, I'm not going to do that. So once that's done, just hit add command. As you can see, the command has been successfully added. And now we can go ahead and add our ban command. So it's gonna be, I'm gonna command. So it's gonna be ban, one head. And then we have kick. And then we can also go ahead and add one. And so those of you who actually use the command, add the command, and also go ahead and add that. So that's pretty much it. Uh, when you run the command, you run it like you would usually do uh, the regular mod command. The only difference is the actual command name so it's actually a little bit shorter so you might be able to mute people or you know do what you have to do a little faster so instead of typing out mute you just do question mark m followed by the user and then the length and the reason and then you have secretly muted someone in a way so i'm going to go ahead and switch over to discord to show you guys what this command looks like in action all right, so here we are in Discord. Let's show off one of these commands. So I'm just gonna go ahead and show off the warn command, which is just W, and then I mentioned the user I want to warn, and then I would go ahead and enter the reason. I'm just gonna do test. And as you can see, no response from Dino, command is gone. But if I come over and look at logs, you can see I have actually warned myself, so the command does work. So thanks again to Hello Hi for providing us with this command. Hopefully you guys found this video useful, and I hope you find the commands useful as well. So thanks for watching, and don't forget to leave me some of those juicy custom commands in the comments. I'd really like to see what you guys uh, come up with. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe.